The question I want to start with is, how will you spend your days, your weeks, your, your years in serving the Lord? You don't have to be a sports person. You don't have to be uh, a student of theology to serve God. You, you may be in your different fields, but how will you spend your days, your weeks, your years uh, in serving the Lord? I, I want to bring greetings to all of you from 200 plus countries. Why I say 200 plus countries? Sports, we have a global movement and today we have about 200 plus countries working together. What an amazing opportunity to be together. And so we are not just here alone, but the whole, almost the whole globe is now journeying together and having fun, learning together, and also trying to follow Christ faithfully. And sport is, and I'm going to just share a few of the things this morning. Today, when we look at our world, 85% of the total world population loves sports. You see that? 85% of the total world population loves sports. Just 25 left. Okay. But we are hoping that we will this percentage will increase because of the the technology, because of the smartphones, the phones that you have with you. So now when we look at this 85% and so there is one place strategic for making disciples and all of us are uh, commissioned to go and make disciples and there is one place where we can make disciples is in the world of sport and play because there are 85% here. I'll just give you an example. Youth attendance, think of your youth services. Bell do you ring for two minutes. Come on, youth can here. three minutes, Marelevi, you hardly have you know few people, bunch full of people. You make arrangement, dinner arrangement, meal arrangement, you to any They love food. We love food, so we'll just go. But if it is a program, different program, gospel camp, things, maybe hardly, only good ones will go. So that is our word. But I want to say this this morning. The mission field for the youth today is sports world. Sports world. There are 85% here. And Sports stadium is one of the most populated fields in the world. Can you imagine? Mohalangan Naga context is maybe maybe not right. Because we have few audience only. Cricket kill it again, those genre side again. Twenty side again. But just we are we are part of the global culture now and we see to it. And so this when we look at this a big stadiums, can just imagine. Too many people, 70, 80, 90,000 just sitting together to witness a single match live. And we have access to all these matches with the technology today. And so that is the advantage. And this is our, and this is our, you don't, you don't need to be a sports person to do ministry or to share something uh, about Christ to someone. You just need a heart. And I'm going to just challenge us this morning that I get excited when I travel around um, different countries, we work, working with different people. I have a close friend who who tahan laga, hat na thala, bis close friend bi kumba zet, teng na thala, kumba zet. We work together. It's interesting. We all work together. Kumba don't professional kumba zet. Kumba simply ini they have a heart to do ministry, so we work together. And my dream, my dream is wanted to see great professionals working and maybe encouraging each other. I haven't met, I haven't met a, 
Kaka and Neymar. How many of you know Kaka? Kaka Kitan? <laughs> okay, I haven't met Lok Tu Kurene. Neymar Lok Kurene. But I work close with their chaplain. Chaplain is my friend. Every year we meet and we discuss about their life. Tankina sport use Kurina Manuka disciple Bana Kinaga Isolaga, you know, gospel to proclaim great. Amazing. Look, Pan is not, you know, you just, you just feel close uh, with them when you see uh, these people. Uh, this morning, I have just a few thoughts in my mind, and I wanted to say this sport is carrying light to the darkest area khande na pare laga jaga khande sport jabo pare sports has a power sports to talaga power as a ministry aban sports ministry do poila bara take up green hai as a recreation as a recreation recreational activity maybe volleyball kilewo then we pray together football kilewo then we pray together maybe inagado ahi as nigi but that's maybe church have not realized that we have the, this opportunity where we can take this as an intentional ministry, not just an event conduct, but ongoing like a ministry group. We have millions and millions of people faithfully following Christ today in the world of sports and play. And it's amazing to see this happening across the globe. Those days we just have few people, Kaka, Luis, and these people only we know. Maybe Stephen Curry. All these people, few people we know that who follow Christ faithfully in the world of sports. But today we have millions of people following Christ faithfully in the world of sports and play. So this is this is the work of the ministry. And this sports ministry is one of the fastest growing in making disciples across the globe. It's amazing. And this, when we look at this, Amehan is so like our greatest commission to fulfill Gura Dikina This is... This is where I started. I'm not going to share the name of this person this morning because this guy belonged to the Czechian community. I started the sports ministry with this. I had a very few, and I think I, I, I saw the one who stood up this morning to sing from Dezepe. Uh, she, was, uh, she, she was Sunday school, and then by the time I was about to leave, I think she was already in the youth group. Her elder sister, brother, were my part of my youth. So they have witnessed. I started with one ball. I started my ministry with one ball. It didn't disconnect. I mean, I served as youth pastor for seven years in the Fort NAP, Badland Church. So prayer meeting na jai na football kili wale jai jile. One evening in the Mamuzara Kiligna, Kushibra, I did a church, Baha Punja Logo. He just came out from the church, prayer meeting, bra. praise the Lord, praise the Lord, I can eat him, Ulaja. So, Muk Bia Kurul and Adivide, Mandaka Maf Guru, Divide, Morom Guru, Divide, with Ajola. Ulaja, Ula Logo, and Agaija Milogo then. He came with his finger. Youth pastor, this is not good. Church pray meeting na nahi na ground de jado thik no hai. This is very was painful. And by then I was not married, so I uh, wanted to give him this. But I knew that iso lakuta de kuna says self control is one of the fruits of the spirit. Ahi je je gorom hoy je je olibi. I just shut my mouth. I control myself. Now they say, after one year, you wouldn't believe the same dikan can with five fingers. Or tala finger with dangor de inga. No, the reason why because they come to know that bel mari libi yud na hero. Sobji ba bagai libi khawa aru jai jai na hai. Evening walk jawo aru. Walk tam de de ni boyfriend girlfriend bera wo ni khushi bara bera wo to bichide they'll just disappear. We tried almost everything to attract our youth. Well, we zook, 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 zook. It was consistency now, like, and so that's where we saw that 
And after I got involved with sports ministry, Ajin Isnaika, I just got the opportunity to hear someone speaking about sports ministry. Then I started with this one simple ball, grounded Jaja, 60-70 without any invitation to any available time. Jaja, grounded. You can't. Motahan ng klan, oye, Mikey Kambi, Jaja. Egg din bi chakela na, grounded. Program egg din bi bana na, grounded. But that's where we started our prayer cell from ground. That's where we started our Bible study from ground. It will be chida do? Youth lamb members to will do? Every week increase for us through. I did not invite them to come to church, but they knew that I was a leader in the church. And so out of respect, out of reverence, and I, I deal with them here, they started coming to church. And so the attendance grew very fast. And I think I, I left the church um, responsibility, ekta climax, ekta de charge, and I felt so good. You come bish about like in a mega morom brigana, a kilo kushi, tahala tani, tadami jay jay jay. Morom tadam de jay jay balan. On the nigger slip, not bragging. That's the best years throughout your life. Jay lady, ne, I'm the kushi by the go. So I think I left. So the reason why I shared this is sport can do. Yadebra na paria laga, sports paria laga ekta ase. So I want to just convey this one and. All of you are, since all of you are prepared, prepared to play sport today, I'm going to give you a very simple um, tip. Maybe I'll give you three simple principles that you can practice because Ajo and I, we were just talking about this. In the evening, you will be tired. Evening, the Aru Gospel, maybe half of us may not come. Only you office bears can I over see why office bears can that's not going to serve the purpose so what we can do we can make a difference and this is where I'm just sitting here as an intro giving you an introduction I want to say this in Colossians 4 when you look at Colossians 4 chapter 4 you see beautiful verses 2 3 4 5 6 beautifully written and this is where I'm going to challenge us with this. Today, this sport is a language that everyone understands. Puriawala, Napuriawala, Bacha, Dangor, Buri, Bura. Everyone understands this sport. This is the language we can use to bring transformation to our families, to bring transformation to our communities, our churches. This is the tool, this is the language we can use to reach out to our friends who are not here with us yet. Great opportunity and we have this privilege as youth. You have energy, you have beauty, you have resources. You have years ahead of you, we can all do. So I'm just going to say this. Copy, okay, just follow me. Okay, so I'm going to show you three actions, okay. How many of you are going to play volleyball? Can I see your hands? Volleyball, boys, girls. Okay, good. How many of you are going to play penalty kick, right? Sorry, penalty kick only. How many of you are going to play football? Okay, so you have penalty, uh, football and volleyball. So you, you, if you are a cricket player, if you are a Ludo player, if you are a carom board player, Whatever sport you are with, just keep that in your mind. So I'm going to say, I want you to follow me saying, pray. pray. So if you are a volleyball player, you can do a spike. Okay. If you are a footballer, you can do the kicking. If you are a Ludo player, <laughs> if you are a marble player, whatever sport you are with. Okay. So pray, play. Okay, say. So these are three things I'm going to help us during this day and tomorrow. Pray. Colossians chapter 4 verse 2 following says, Devote yourself to prayer. Prayer is powerful. Prayer is a weapon for us. And as an athlete, you may not be a professional player. professional 
We may not, Olivia, I'm so killed. We try to play almost everything. We're not master, any ekta devi master no, Olivia, so to chew over everyone. That's a gift for us. And so, pray before the game, during the game, after the game. That's important. Pray. Abni mukte bhiya kule la time de bhi. Ami ke kona de bhi. Noli bhi manu ke enjoy kona de bhi. Abni la official sangar ne. Abni la opponent sangar ne. Just prepare yourself. Pray that God will give you strength. Pray that God will give you opportunity. Just pray. Pray is important. Dressing room de. Try to pray. Communicate and be prepared. Ami kan ground de jai na. Focus. 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 Koi dona. Attention to be the tag you girlfriend gay, baby, you know, holy go to Barbara and Ajawi. Boyfriend gay, baby, you know, no, it's good distraction, but I'm gonna get focus. Who are gonna focus? Focus your coach have to remind you, pray that you stay focused. Giving your best is more important than winning because we play for the audience of one, and so we want you to pray hard, pray hard, pray loud. Before the game, during the game, keep communicating. Paul Bra Sukubon Grina hi Pratna Gribu Kanoe. Hodai Pratna Gribi. Kweje. So it is about your heart communicating to the heart of God. So it's about communication. And so pray for this. Pray that God will open up a door for you to play well. And when you play, pray, play. When you play, you will play a better game. When you are prepared, your performance will change. Abni la focus, Abni la pratna gura. I remember, sorry to say this, I still play football. There's a pen, but they kumba ekilo wode kili na ikunge mara mari kuna hakuma. I can see some of them. Kumba dikhi aze, dikhi na kuchhi pa aze. Those days different, okay? Maaf guri we. Okay, so I studied in uh, Oriental College, so we play. Football a lot with discipline, but they are in a lot of it. Holy cow tournament, they kill it. It's a cow, keta wole gane to chuchi in a hikili da ya man. So it's, it was fun. So one day I I, I was so I play striker. So I play uh, as a striker. One day I was imagining in a gajale, a jidu duita gold war. Already prepared a jig duita gold war. Aro, ekta do, if I ever do. I have already prepared in my mind ahead of the game match. Now gonna I run a lot. Rati de polite, polite, polite. I just exercise to keep myself fit. And now gonna the next day it was not a magic, but I scored exactly the way I imagined. Chance by gonna. It was something I'm gonna lesson the only like that will be when you prepare yourself. Prayerfully, your performance will come according to the way you prepare your mind, your heart. Pray that when you play, you will be able to play well because the word of God says in that that your conduct, apila conduct to do manuge agide presentable ho bolaye. Edo koi na thagi na sa. So it's important for us that. Yeah, they were like, "Tum ball is not going to go ground the jagna." If you start with these things, pulling someone's the same person, you're going to be the same person. So that's why it's important for us that you train yourself when you play. Manu ke mari dili. Ah, sorry, sorry. Piche the ekla brai. Koi ko gole bi, kovi gole bi. At least before then, sorry, sorry. Try to exercise that. I'm sorry. Gole bi inaga. So. So this is the preparation. Pray, play. So when you play well, harali bi jiti li bi. I appreciate the way you played. Enaga khili je, enaga khili je. Baal thagi je, enaga laga. And maybe a lot time the barbie lo kure na. Ole bi. This is the first time you are meeting in the in a match. So just be good to him, to her. Maybe that will be the only opportunity for you to meet that guy, that person in your lifetime. Just be good to him or to her. Jai dena hai. If you go with that attitude, that is not going to work. But if you stand there, say hi, you know, all the best. Just be too good to them in your game. 
And so when you play well, when you show good conduct to your ma mate, to your officials, to the audience, audience also will enjoy. Tahan haray jo libi. I like the way they played. Bishi baat hai kisi. Manu ke girai libi hangsi ke na olai diye, uthai diye, na galaga. So when you do that, the last thing is say, pray, play, say. You will have the opportunity to share the gospel. You will have the opportunity to share something good to someone else. Don't waste because the word of God says in that Colossians, make use of the best opportunity. Opportunity waste not really. I mean not time ekta dia do le do don't waste. So a single word is important or two is important. Ito opportunity padam de. Just share your story or just share gospel or if someone is down. Please share something that will encourage your friend. And this is all about disciple making principles from the Colossians book chapter 4 verse 2 to verse 6. That's what I wanted to uh, share to all of you. Let's all do one more time the action. Pray, play, say. One, two, go. Pray, play. Second, we say it louder. One, two, go. Pray, play, say. Okay, so I hope this will remind you as you begin to play penalty, volleyball, if you can apply this one, it will be interesting. And if you can exercise this one in these two days, this will be useful principles for your lifetime. And this is what exactly God wants the youth people. And when you have this one, 85 percentage love sports, we have this as a mission field. You can become professional, or even if you don't become professional, you can still do great ministry serving God using these principles. I'm going to just going to give you a gift, a small token this morning. Okay, you have given me big gift, but I'm going to give you a round gift. <laughs> okay, <laughs> which is about eternity. Okay, this is a special ball called J316 ball. This is a special design customized ball, okay, we manufacture and we are doing ministry with this. Sunday school teacher, maybe Sunday schools also they share about Christ, color, and today we have come this. Why we made this one? Why we invest our money on this ball? Because here is 85 people playing this. 85 Manu. Kushi Pavra, Kushi Pajaga and Ajale, Manu Pajaga and Ajale, praise the Lord, good Haina Manu Nahilvi, it's not going to work. Grounded Jagina, Mamati Livi, Eti Manu Tagahiba. So that's where we invest here. And so the color, the gold, the gold represent heaven and earth, heaven. And so God created for God so love, even though we sinned, He loved us so much that He sent His Son Jesus Christ, Ren, that whoever believes in Him, are washed away, are made righteous, okay, and we continue to grow. And as we, we are washed, so for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, whoever, whoever believes in him shall not die, okay, shall not die, but as we continue to live, we will grow as a, as a growing, as a victorious, we will live as a victorious Christian green. And when we continue to live a victorious Christian life, even if we die, we get back to heaven. The heaven. We have eternity. He's the Alpha and He's Omega. So this is where I thought, I just wanted to hand over this, uh, I think I brought 17 balls. 17 churches, right? So I'm going to give one ball each to all the 17 churches. Okay? In future, if you need more calling, <laughs> talk to you, okay? You will send me a message, okay? So we have this, we have also um, wristbands, the same color, okay? The same color, so we, we manufacture and we do ministry. So as I hand over this one, I'm just going to end with this. Just a 40 second story. Again, Asam de Jaina Taguje, Itu Bolvara Jaina. Jungle the da gije. We were playing in the jungle. Bacha ekta do cycle. Idu bi opore chulao na bore. Middle parhi chulaige na gije. 
ตายกิชิรกุยเจตายอาสามิสตุบุเจวุเจอังกฤษนาบุเจสอมีฟอนบราปัดอาสามิสลากาเวอร์ชั่นดูไลกินาเจ 360 2 360 <laughs> We have some dress like a DJ. And now we're going to take a chai DJ. On our way back home, to in team and then there's no bacha khan jai gina gospel huni ta yeta lo obra. You imagine this. Sport has power. I mean, I'm bisas na gure la jaga na sup grow for it. So God bless you. And we look forward. This is an introduction. And I'm, I'm glad to uh, Ajo. Uh, I hegina apne hal ode connection banao parise I'm excited to be part of your your ministry and we look forward not just today uh, and then we end but we look forward working together and see how we can work together and be part of the global movement impacting our world our communities our churches so yeah please this ball okay along with this I think I have a I'm going to also give you a very small manual. Very small man small. I mean a generation to small no hello achi like it. Okay. Steta san is not any but side over all la. Okay. So here is a here is a, a small manual attached with this ball. Please read this manual or you can also log on to our website or our insta and just see what we do with this uh, ball. So yeah, so Time now is it? But God bless you. Uh, volleyball be as a football be as a. So you decide, okay? And see uh, if anyone want to do ministry in your church in your area. Please feel free to contact Ajo and see uh, what we can do together. God bless you.